it. It is 19, we'll just call it $20,000. How do you like the name Cricket? Looks like this is a, you got size it down a little bit. Looks like you can sleep two people. The back opens up. And this is worldwide. Again, it does have an air conditioning in it. Tent pop-up style. This is worldwide RV. Again, this is called the Cricket. It does have a table. Looks like it can sit about four people. A lot of bungees. A little kitchen area here. You could probably bring a microwave or a look at the air conditioner right there. Again, this is what they call the Cricket. Nice little getaway for the weekend. Everything pops right up. And this is the Cricket. It's Zachary Jacobs. Welcome to Online RV TV. Please join us as we take adventures across the United States. Going to different towns, going to different communities, going to different little places, little events, big events, and just checking out the United States. We will also be spreading the gospel of Jesus Christ across the land. Also,
This is the Alpha Sia Leather Seats Air Cushion System Television. Largest slide in the industry. Captain's chairs. Definitely a nice coach here. This sofa pulls out and you're sleeping on a leather bed. Feels just like this when it flips out. Again, industry standard. Look how deep that slide is. This one has a fireplace put in the unit. And this coach normally has a trash bin sitting right here. There's no trash bin at this in this one, but most seniors come with a trash bin. And also has fishing rod storage. Right up here you can store your fishing rod in this unit. You have a coach. This television right here is for when you're sitting here and the coach is running, you're able to watch TV. Now, remember, there's still a TV right here. Alright, coming over here, we do have a three burner stove. And a microwave. Convectionary oven. So you do have the combination of both. Definitely has deep sinks with a pull-out right here. Tons of storage. And a two-door refrigerator with an ice maker in this. So plenty of room here. Plenty of room. Tons of storage up top in this coach. Going all the way across. Tons of room. All right, and tons of room of storage here once again. Everything locks in place. Tons of room of storage. This unit does have a washer and dryer all in one. Again, with tons of room of storage in this coach. Nice, roomy bathroom. I can stand up in once again. This is the Alpha Sia. Tons of room. This whole slide right here. This whole slide right here is tons of room for storage. Also have this classic television so you could be laying back and the intake system to keep this coach cool all the time. like nice pretty backgrounds well I'm out there dealing with the homeless every day they don't have that opportunity some of the times they don't know where they're going to get their next meal the times they just need a person to listen to so I like to donate some of my time a portion of my time to go ahead and help the homeless and just give what I can sometimes it's not a lot sometimes it's just giving water sometimes it's just giving a little food they like to be able to be heard and let, they like to be able, sometimes they just want a, an ear, someone to take interest. They love the church because the church gives them clothes and a lot of them just want a job. A lot of them just want an opportunity to be able to help someone else. A lot of them just want to be able to get up and help someone else just like I would like to pay it forward. You can go to of our 2005 pop-up camper by Coleman. It is a West Lake. We have the potty area that is right here. We have the door area. We have electrical outlets right here. Barbecue grill goes right there. We have storage that goes all the way across. Battery hookup goes there. And we have two king size beds in this coach right here. Nice canopy in here, no holes, no rips, no repairs.
refrigeration right there, excess. We have our water right there. Furnace. Everything taken care of right there. This is good, well maintained for the year. Again, great canopy, no water damage or anything like that. Go inside. Alright, inside we have two large beds here, we have a nice lounge area over here, this, turn, uh, this pops out to a bed so it sleeps seven very com comfortably, this goes down and sits right on the floor. Store thing to that. Today, I have a question for you. Are you for sure, without a doubt, that if you died right now, that you would have eternal life? What is eternal life? If you were to die right now, would you know for sure that you would have eternal life? Well, the Bible lets us know that, and you will know that today. Um, eternal life is that work of God which guarantees God's gift of salvation once received is possessed forever and cannot be lost again can you lose your salvation that is the question and at today's question and I'm going to answer today what is salvation all right salvation is deliverance from eternal death and possession of eternal life again can you lose your salvation that is the question today. Are you saved? And are you for sure you're saved? Well, John 5, 13 says that you may know that you have eternal life. That means you are secure and you are saved. Amen. We are also out here looking at our fifth world today. I'm going to base six questions to you today as we walk around our camper here. As I said, this is online RV TV. We do go around the country and minister to those that don't want to It's a great opportunity we have. And I want to ask you six questions. Which group do you fall in? Are you unsaved and know that you're unsaved? This is a false sense of security, no security at all. Are you unsaved and think that you're saved? This is a false sense of security. Are you safe and uncertain about your salvation? You are unsure. Are you saved and beyond, beyond a shot of a doubt believe that you're saved? You are sure of your salvation. Or are you saved and uncertain of your salvation? You are unsure. Are you saved and sure but...